Welcome back. Um, this video, I want to go over the widgets in the iDrive 8 system. This is the 2023 BMW 760, which is my favorite car to go over the iDrive 8, just because this car is filled with options. As you can see there in front of us, we have a camera, which is missing in a lot of the other cars, but this car has it. Anyways, it might be just an option on how you build it. But this is the main screen. Of course, I like using this controller. And I already com uh, complained in another video about uh, this controller. It's a little tight, the iDrive controller. See, it clicks. You could probably hear the click. Um, but it barely moves. And it's, it's tight for such a luxury car to have, you know, glass controls to change your transmission and also to start your engine. This thing is, uh, it's not as useful as the standard one that's not glass, that has an actual, uh, stands taller, and it's more soft in a good way. Anyways, I like using this controller, and the X1 is missing it. I hope they don't take it away, because, um, I don't know, I don't know, I, I like it. I like feeling the increments, but this screen is also a touch screen, and you, we have multiple, multiple things here. And I just want to show you how you can basically move your widgets around. Okay. So, we're going to click here. So, if you wanted to move something to the beginning, you want to click and hold. So, let's say we wanted to bring this BMW over here. You click and hold, and it moves it here. Okay. Okay. And you can also add widgets, of course. So right now we're pretty we're pretty booked. I wonder what else we can add. Um, so there we go. You can add. Oh, you can only add one more thing. This thing. Or you could take them away by hitting the little squares. And now when you click widget, they're hiding in here. So you don't have too many widgets, if you know what I mean. Um, so let's say we went back to our home screen and these little four up top are how you get to all your apps actually you have to press all apps because that's infotainment apps that's the car apps and there are a lot of uh apps in here <laughs> um, we do live in an app world and so how do you move this around as well you want to click and hold and you could uh you could also create a shortcut um, by the way the shortcut goes to the top of the screen so let's jump back you see the blue arrows it disappeared anytime I touch the controller the blue arrows appear and then they disappear there's one up here and there's one here watch I'll move this around you see it and if I shift the whole controller up it takes me up here and this is where you'll be assigning the shortcuts they'll be up here but remember you have to set up a BMW ID first for this car to memorize things and to keep them permanent in this screen um, because your key only controls the steering wheel, the side mirrors, the seat, and your heads up display but it also connects you to your profile right away so you don't have to go dig for it. This car's profile is not set up yet because you could see this little guy up here is not a picture. Um, but after you set up your profile then you can customize your apps much easier. You just click and hold and then you move around and it should stay where you moved it to. Okay, um, I hope this video was informative. I had to make this just because, you know, there are too many apps now and someone buying the 7 Series is probably going to be, yes, there are successful younger people out there, but they're, they might be older and their technology is overwhelming. And the buttons are gone. Our smart keys are gone. So now if you click and hold, you have to click and hold and wait and then there's shortcut and you can add it to the top of the screen shortcut gestures so you can set up a two at the screen so two fingers at the screen or a five fist five for something else sorry my phone uh, phone's going blurry there there we go just got a new phone here I'm testing out the the picture which I actually pretty like it's nice and crisp anyways thanks for watching until next time.